Welcome on back, Cloud City. It's Boy Cloud, and we are back with some more Black Myth Wukong for you today. Getting up literally right where we left off from the last episode. We're ready to continue exploring the zone. Uh, I did go through and I was reading up on, um, how'd you say his name? Lingzuxi? Okay, so with him. The Grey Wolf of the Guy, or the Grey Wolf Guy of the Temple was once an exile from the Kingdom of Shito. When Shito was laid to ruin, the wolves fed, following the Grey Wolf on a long and weary road until they found shelter under the banner of the Black Wind King. Unlike the old Lingzuxe, however you said his name, who pursued immortality and detachment, the Grey Wolf cared nothing for the ways of deities and Buddha nor for the empty promises of eternal life and said his heart was set in mastering strength and skill his he honed his craft with iron claws and fangs until he could strip the very flesh from the bones of his foes when the old lingzuxi vanished black bear guai black bear guy guai saw fit to alleviate the gray wolf to be the new master of the wolf guys giving him the name lingzuxi and tasking him with guarding the the Guayan Temple. The wolf guys, the wolf guys, who came with the new Lingzuxe from the kingdom of Shito, also rose in power and surpassed those who had served longer in the distribution of spoils and favors at the local wolf guys. <laughs> That's gonna be, it's gonna be a pain. I, I keep saying guys, and I'm meaning to say guys. <laughs> the local wolf guys had little affection for the ways. Of the new Lingzuxe, and after finding themselves thrust aside, bitterness took root in their hearts and their shared sense of grievance. They found a new unity of purpose. Often they gathered in secret comfort, comforting each other, sharing the old memories when the old master was in power and the quietly plotting against the new one. Damn, man, there is like a whole ass like book to this thing. <laughs> But Lingzuxe was prepared under the pretense of a roll call. He gathered the local wolf, wolf guys in the temple and gave the signal to his loyal guards to seize the malcontents. So the temple erupted into chaos. Lingzuxe then leaped down from the roof into the crowd. So that's why he did that. Ready to devour all who dared to betray him. The fireblade wolf, hearing the commotion, rushed over and managed to hold Lingzuxe off and brought the minions time to flee to safety and black when king learned of this he was ready to unleash punishment upon the rebellious wolf guys wolf guys and but the snake guy mediated and the peace was restored yet from the day forth the local wolf guys refused to tread even within the shadow of the walls of the guayan temple so that explains why we have snake enemies near, uh, nearby that explained why the fireblade wolf was nearby as well and why we got his spell that explained uh, uh, explains a lot so definitely definitely reading up on those if you guys are going through this same time i am definitely uh definitely worth it I'll wait for you to animate. There's a lot of them. I mean, they're not, it's not like they're strong or anything. But then mixed in with Snake Bitch might make for an interesting fight. Oh, yeah. Ouch. Get rid of the fodder first. Boom, boy. Or. 
So yeah, that's that's the thing with this zone. Be prepared for poison. Let's get rid of all of you guys first. It's over here. Snakehead mushroom along with another one of these guys. Do we want to go this way? Just looks like a dead end. It's because it is dead end. Random statue head. Okay, we got a snake. Snake guy. Let's go ahead and mobilize. Your stance. I'm ready for my Shadow Clone Jutsu now. Ooh, I have two. Dodging no longer interrupts the light attack combo. That sounds crucial. I want it. So then I could go up, 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 up. Pretty good. Doing full heal. I think a double healed on that. Um, ooh, Shane. Man, I'll whip all of your asses. Let's go ahead and just get all of you up, cause you guys are ridiculous. certain statues that you could destroy I'm not sure if I was like one of them or not wait okay we've already been up that way let's uh grab this try to hide in there ah that'd be why you're hiding big thud Try to run for me, bitch. You fail. I can see me and Pillar Stance being very good friends. Oh god, what's going on here? This humble one's name is Guangmo. Should my demise come by your hands, please Guang pass Mo. this message to my master. Searching for deity. Mortals do aspire. Craving immortality, Yao Guai's surely will conspire. Oh shit. Hey, he's got poison. Yeah, I'm gonna fuck you up, bud. Oh, you still got it off. That was a waste. That's what I gotta watch out for that poison.
Big dud. Pretty cool. I like that animation. What of the Iron Bowl? Evil monks abetted Elder Jincha to burn the great sage and Chang Mun alive. That's these two. I thought they were already turned into ashes by that fire. Who would have thought they had turned into Yao Guais? I think that's where I came from. So we have this way, and then we have up there. Okay, this is looking like progression because we have the gold gold trail there. I want to go up this way then. There's another bell. I'm here. It seems as though the resentment in the depths of the mountain has grown. Ah, oh, forget it. Overthinking won't help. Your presence has already made a mess in the mountain. Why not go ahead and take them out once and for all? Yeah, might as well. I wonder if that's like something that we're supposed to do is like ring a bell or... It's like kind of like uh, Lords of the Fallen or something. We're ringing like maybe we're not supposed to ring the bells. This isn't like Lords of the Fallen, uh, the newer one, cleansing the beacon. If you don't cleanse cleanse them, you get uh, what two two different endings. But if you cleanse them all, you get one ending. So I'm wondering if there isn't multiple multiple endings to this. Okay, so we could cultivate. So I'm assuming what cultivate means is we upgrade. Take the form of um, Guang Mao. Cough with snakes to spit venom upon foes and inflict poison damage. The snakes will slither away once their venom is depleted. No, I like I like the the big heavy thud. So let's cultivate that. So that's what Blood of the Iron Bowl is for. It's an upgrade mat to upgrade your spirits. Okay, good to know. Okay, so now we had... So, okay, what's this first? Frag... Fragrant vine, okay. I thought it said fragment vine on my whole. So do we go this way? There's more snake wise down there. Let's go back. I mean, I think there was just this path and the other path, but I just want to make sure. Yeah, this is where we entered the fight from, yeah? Yeah. Okay, so yeah, it's just it's just those two. Okay. It's fine. Just wanted to make sure. are nothing to fear 
Snake gall steeped in drink, though, makes a fine tonic to flush malady. Here, here, young friend. Be my guest inside. Oh, dude, that was cool. They got rid of my, my poison for me. Thanks, buddy. So we're meeting, we're meeting a couple NPCs. I'm liking this. Massively reduce the stamina cost of jumping. Each talent level moderately increases focus gain for perfect dodges. I like how I'm just like constantly just going down the stamina. I don't even know why. I mean, they all just sound good, I guess. Each talent level considerably increases stamina recovery rate when health is above half. It's like this does sound good and massively reduce the stamina cost of jumping. After sprinting, the light attack starter temporarily deals more damage. What's this? Each talent level slightly reduces the duration of four Bane's effect. Each talent level increases critical hit chance. I feel like I should be doing some of these. Grants a considerable amount of damage reduction when performing Sweeping Gale. Oh, dude, that's cool. With over three focus points, the Destined One can use the Gourd when perching on the staff. Destined One no longer falls to the ground when perching, but instead executes a heavy attack on stamina depletion. Turning Gale depletes all focus points and deals damage based on the points consumed. I can either say that one or now nah, let's get, let's get this, and then I'm probably gonna get Soaring Strike. Bro, him, what you got for me? I'd stake your one more monkey from Mount Huaguo. Uh, I've met many of you. I upgrade Gord, upgrade Drain Brew Store. Oh, so that's what the those vines are for, is to upgrade Gord uses. Oh yeah. Upgrade drinks. Awaken wine worm, okay. So we need those wine worms and it increases it from 33% to doesn't exactly say. Brew. Oh, so we can slot something into our health. Using the gourd moderately increases poison resistance for a short duration. Brew of bravery, fresh brew and old cask. May it stir a great risk. Oh, a great task. <laughs> I thought it said a great risk. I'm like, home? <laughs> what? Still got, I still got that morning vision, you know? Uh, For a brief moment after using the gourd, slowly recovers a small amount of health. For a brief moment, what? Twelve palaces rise, nine floors high, jade pool adjoined, emerald stream nigh. The moon's celestial abode shines bright. I don't know, is that worth getting? <laughs> you have a sharp sight, young friend. Oh, so instead of poison resistance. Hey, I see. Next time, down a few mouthfuls in one go. It's delightful. <laughs> so there's no, there's no talk. Shen Monkey is his name. I drink all there is. Okay, so there's a chest here. 
wonder if there's any new armor we can craft. It's like a cave of some sort. Okay. Snake head mushroom. I'm just a little, little cove. You know, for running it on quality, it I really haven't experienced uh, a whole hell of a lot of frame drops. What's going on here? Hailed bird, hailed bird, what dimmed your shine? Past's grip beyond our grasp, the future we may still clasp. Oh shit. Late White clad is the hour, noble. young one, in which you choose to stain my tranquil abode. Pray tell, to what end do you seek? Okay, so I'm just gonna go all out and say, bro, the fucking amount of boss fights is great. Okay, I'm gonna have to ask you, sir, to sit here. Oh, I don't. Have it. That was a waste. He's too fast. Even for this, he's still too fast. You weren't ready for this. Oh, let's see if you have a second phase, because it didn't say defeated. You have forced my hand. Now you shall face what I truly am. Oh, shit, two phases. Okay, so let's get back down there.
Oh jeez, Brett. Really, while I'm recording? Come on, buddy. A ripple awakens, not without a This is a good start. Okay, I like how I could combo that. That was like a double stagger effect. Such a good run too. Okay, so I think I see how I'm gonna get through his first phase fairly quickly. We immobilize him. He's gonna get staggered from that. Right where it's about to go. Oh, and I missed! This bitch. Ouch. Yeah, you're using my stance, bro. Yes, though. What I truly yeah, I should have guessed because, like, your eyes definitely give it away. I'm gonna heal right in front of you. Stop slipping away from me, you son of a bitch. Don't like that. Time for the transformation to go up.
We have a hit. Oh, don't know how I did that. Dude, I was like one touch. <laughs> I'm merely my brother's eyes and ears. I feign my loyalty to guard this path on the bear's order. Your destiny is bleak and stark. In its grip, we share the mark. The Guanyin Temple now lies in cinders, yet the Elder Soul endures. The root of greed ever fosters the stem of suffering. <sighs> to forget the thing you truly seek. Jade Fang. The three bells. Have you seen them all? Uh, no. Do you too desire that which they ceaselessly hold dear? The bells. Three bells were set in the mountains since the Black Winged Wise returned, yet no one is allowed to go near them. Maybe the bells have something to do with the temple's burning. His words sound like truth to me, little monkey. Stay sharp and keep a lookout. Yeah, that definitely looks like the next bell. Uh. Oh, shit. Please tell me you guys are just like fodder. Ah. Dude, one touch from you guys, I am dead. Okay, there we go. Oh my god. <laughs> Is that the... That's gotta be the wolf that they were talking about. And the, and the thing. three bells and opened a key and we got a load screen uh oh wonder if I should have waited ancient one temple It took me right there. Well, I mean, it healed me, fully restored my gourd. Uh, hopefully there's a shrine. It's like we need like a wrap up point. Here becomes an incense stick. Craft weapon. Ooh. Serpent Staff, Jade Fang, Stone Spirit, Will. Moderately increase the damage of light tech combo finishers. The effect is massively enhanced when fighting in water. Sure. Oh, 
Well, armor. Your health is low, so it recovers a small amount of health if in water the effect is enhanced. Massively reduces stamina cost when in water. It's not bad. I'm not gonna worry about crafting it. Um, can we travel? Oh, this is a secret. Okay. So then, yeah, this is back to where we were. Okay, so yeah, we'll go ahead and wrap up. And then in the next one, we'll tackle this uh, secret zone. So stay tuned. More Black Myth Wukong will be coming your guys' way.